Are, are, are you, are you going to put this in as like the, the beginning thing where just a music background plays? Yeah, and then we'll do like a little, a little cinematics of us driving. Yes, some bugs can have bad experiences with their parents, like they might have been abused as a child. So you gotta watch out for which tarantula you get. Okay. So we've made like a preliminary sweep, if you will. So we looked around, kind of seen what's out here, what they got, and now we go by. I wanna, I wanna have a lot of this. I think that's how you pronounce it. Species Columbia, so it's like a pumpkin patch. I also want a Pennsylvania and a curly hair, and then maybe some dubia roaches. See what you can get. What about you, Brandon? Uh, I, I'm thinking about getting a. There's like a twenty-five dollar. Uh, which species, but it was like a sort of starter snake, and it was about, I'd say like it was a two foot snake, but it was pretty thin. But I'm gonna get that, I'm gonna get a pumpkin patch sling, but I don't know yet. Uh, yeah, let's, let's, let's get going. Yeah. Enough to sort of start up like breeding a couple. I don't know about breeding moon crabs. Do not know how to do it. I've, I've never heard of them breeding them. But if you look at the. Do you have any females? If you look at this guy. Oh. <laughs> He's fine. If you look at this one right here, see how everything is much lighter uh, in color? I just thought that was because no. they were due for a mold. No, yeah. that's just going to be female coloration. So, wait, do you have a. Two females and a male? Probably. I, I know for sure I've got this male. Yes. Just got three moon crabs being held off uh, Two females, or, yeah, two females and a male. Why just getting one male?
So, can these be handled or will they be like... No, they can. You can do it. You just gotta make sure that... Gotta be careful, just like... Yeah. That's a little mouth. Wait, can I handle them? Ooh! They are fast. But yeah, that's a little male right there. How fast? Like Huntsman Spider fast or like... I wouldn't say Huntsman Spider. They're fast. I like to move. Can you huh. pinch me? I'm gonna stick a finger in there. You're not gonna want to get pinched. I don't think he's gonna want to pinch you, but if, you, if you're aggressive Woo! with him, he will. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And you can just hold him with Brandon's. Hold him over here. Yeah. All right, guys. Let me give you this. That way, if I forget, y'all can just give this and remind me. I'll talk to a lot of people today. Thank you, sir. Not a problem, guys. Have a good afternoon. So, why are you getting in with Alice and Elijah? I want an Aporia. Okay. So other than the Versicolors, you don't have any other uh, uh, New World Aporias? Because like, right now, I have like 15 bucks left, and the only thing left on my list is a New World Arboreal. Are there any types of tarantulas that will like live with other tarantulas? Yeah, I mean like uh, Balfouri. These guys here, it's a communal species. Some say regalis can be communal, but you have to do it from the get go. You have to have a huge tank. Like, like they have to be put together like as slits. They have to be kept together from the baby. Yeah. So instead of separating them out and putting them in containers, you just leave them together. I'll pick a regalis. A regalis? Okay. So you can just take your pick. I just put food in there for them, so they'll be good for probably about another week and a half. You just feed them crickets? Oh no, do crickets. Roaches. Yeah, but I could get away with feeding them crickets. Oh yeah. Right? And then do be a roach. You don't have to worry about them biting the animal. No. Okay, that's. No. Yeah, because I know uh, crickets, they're pretty elusive, aren't they? Oh, uh, there's this guy. Uh, I think I'll take this one. Take that one? Because I can see him. It's not here. Okay. It's a video of me. Like. There, okay. What is that? Oh, okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> there. There you go. Okay. 100. This might be good for an Aboreal if you had uh, some more sticks in there. Like a Goliath. Yeah, but. I mean, I don't see any that are just tall and not wide. Here, can you hold this? Can I see it? Oh, is that its molt? Or is that? Yeah, that's its molt. molt. Right there. Can't see. Is it a spider? Yeah, tarantula. Oh, yeah. Tree tarantula. Yeah, that's a molt. That'd be even more insane. Cork. You wanna get... I'm just trying to get in some more footage right now. I sort of want to get cork, but eh. Wait, is it 25 for this whole box? Because I don't imagine that's 25 each. Ask. Go, uh, go over there. My dude isn't even moving. 
got curly hair. But he's right there. You can't really see him in the Elijah got one, he's up here. Also got uh, some Dubia roaches, five male, 15 female for like 15 bucks. See ya. And Versicolor. This is like. Ver wait, Versicolor. But it's 30 for a Versicolor sling ball. We got like every species I wanted right here. Yeah, but he's. Uh, except, except for the, the pumpkin patch. Pumpkin patch for 10, I think is a good deal. Yeah, but not, not, I, I'm not gonna get the first color. I'm gonna wear it. Five, six, seven. Alright. Well, that's what we're gonna Thank you, you too. I'm gonna take one of your cards because I'm gonna call you for information. Yeah. Is this you over here? Actually, actually, take one of Bruce's cards. Okay. Bruce is the spider guy. He's the one that bred these, okay? And you can tell him, hey, I bought one of this, you know, I bought uh, one of the pumpkin patches at the show, and I just have a couple questions, we have to take care of Thank you so much. I won't uh, I'll be in a second, like So, Elijah, which one do you get in? Which one do you get in? I think I'll get two pumpkin patches. Two pumpkin patches? If you want to get a pumpkin patch this time, Tiger? What are you counting all that money for? Uh, a little something special. Ooh. Ooh. I, I don't think they would pick up that. Because my husband was reading something about them having like, where Goody was a... My specialty is more monitors. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. My specialty is more monitors and uh, pythons and snakes. I'll show you a picture because he was able to take a really good picture of our, our goody ornamental and you could see the two extra yeah. little at the back. Ooh. So um, let's do this one. Wow, let me awesome. see. He said get the biggest one. The biggest one. Right? <laughs> this body looks bigger, but his, his legs look bigger. Yeah, I mean, they probably round. They're, they look pretty close, huh? Are you ready, Elijah? This body is a little bit longer legs, but this one's probably just a little fat. It probably eats a lot more. This one's, they're probably about the same size, but this one probably doesn't eat just as much as she does. What do you think, Stephanie? I like this one. I didn't say either, but... Well. <laughs> what have you been feeding them? Uh, right now they get roaches, crickets, uh, worms. What size crickets? Large. Oh, perfect. Even at this size, you can try a little pink and ice, but don't be that. If you do a pink and ice, go all good three or four days without feeding yeah. anything. Yeah, not all three. But, yeah, the guy who, I mean, yeah. I could try my best, but like I said, it's probably going to be a good 50% guess on them. I, I think you should get this. This one's darker. I sort of like that. This one has one. less hair on the rump, so that could be female. The males will have a little bit more hair. I'm sort of liking this one. This one looks male. It's got a little bit more hair than what she does. You see inside on that top that rump, the ball spot that she has, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. compared to uh, what he has. But that's 50-50. I mean, don't quote me on that. Uh, uh, yeah, I, 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 like, I like this one right there. I guess I'll take it. This one? Uh, that yeah, one. That the one. The one you said was female. Most likely. Oh, they're apparently Russian tortoises. Uh, here, did we do a... Uh, are Russian tortoises. That's just 50 straight. 50 straight. 50 straight. Because I mean, they were selling uh, slings. Yeah. For like for these for 40, and they were like little babies. Yeah, and those are really hard to take care of. Really yeah. Yeah, y'all enjoy. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Have a good afternoon. Why'd you pumped? Yeah. Pumped I caught a Goliath. Look at bird eater. Wow. Oh, it's looking here. This hairs. is what I got. It is. <laughs> Wait, let me see. Get that. Oh, it is. Look at that arm. I don't think I caught that, but let me get one. It's pretty funny. Yeah, give me one saying you want to do it. Alright. And so, ding dong, the enclosures are done. Oh, that didn't rhyme. Uh, yeah, it's been a few hours later. I, uh, gotta, hold on, I'm gonna center my. There we go. It's uh, it's a few hours later now, and uh, I just had time to like settle them all in and stuff. I don't know why I'm spinning. I just had time to settle all the teas and the uh, moon crab in. I helped Brandon with his. I think the Goliath bird eater. 
was a little more than I can chew. We'll see how that goes. But uh, starting off, I got this tank in our garage. Uh, moon crabs in there. Uh, really fun, lovable guy who pinches and likes to be invisible. Oh, okay, can't really get. I'll 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 film some good shots later. But yeah, he's hid under there all day. He just got uh. Oh gosh, it's so dark without like proper lighting. But uh, yeah, I just got him today. Uh, got that. There's his water dish. Got one of the pieces of cork bark I got. Uh, there's salvia. He's in there. Succulent. I'm moving along. This is the Goliath Bird Eater, who I have been, who I guess I've named Gigas. It's huge. It's a juvenile. Oh man. Um. Moving along. This is. Ugh, don't know if you can see it too well. But uh. All right. This is my curly hair, uh, Brachypelma albapapillosum sling. She's feeding on a cricket, small cricket. Oh, she doesn't like the light. <laughs> yeah, she's feeding on a small cricket. Uh, this is Pipo, my Habilopinus species, Columbia. Hasn't come out of the substrate. Oh, right here in, oh. Right there is my uh, P. regalis. Uh, which I have named Pregal. Uh, in here we got Jarvis, uh, Phonopoma Annex, uh, Rusty, Phonopoma Annex. In here I've got Dubia Roaches. I bought a starter colony for those. And underneath there I got Crickets. That's about it for my collection for now. Is as you, uh, Bean is actually finally at Brandon's. Uh, told Brandon like uh, a month ago that I'd give uh, Bean to uh, him. Bean was his. He until recently, his mom wouldn't let him get tarantulas, but now she has. So now Bean's moved in with him. So it's been nice uh, knowing Bean. I'll miss her. Uh, she was the first tarantula molt I got to experience. And I still get to keep her molt. Uh, but, oh well. I got enough tarantulas as it is. So yeah. There's Herbs Conroe 2017.